everyone, welcome to my channel, Let's Talk About It Media 21. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and please hit the notification bell. That way, every time I upload a video, you will be the first one to see it. No, all comments are alleged in our opinion and for entertainment purposes only, where we discuss celebrity news, celebrity gossip, what's going on on IG and Google, and what's the hot topic for the day or the week. Fair use. Copyright disclaimer under Section 107 of the Copyright Act of 1976, allowances made for fair use for purposes such as criticism, comma, comments, comma, news reporting, comma, teaching, comma, scholarships, and research. Fair use is use permitted by a copyright statute that might otherwise be infringing. All comments are alleged, in our opinion, and for entertainment purposes only. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for supporting the channel. Don't forget to like, to comment. Also subscribe and also turn on the notification bell. That way every time I upload a video, you'll be the first one to see it. And also the cash app is Let's Talk About It Medium. So let's get into it. The K's and the J's are trying to fool people. This is an ad that she's really doing for the sister. I'm not going to read what it's basically trying to sell, but a lot of people are falling off in regards to the products and maybe not buying the products like needed. Many people that was watching the show was frustrated that it was like they were trying to produce or sell items. Many people are fooled. This is fake. Her putting it in, they knew that people were going to speak about it. Now, mind you, in regards to the different lines they have, because they have so many, and they're so similar to other products that people can buy from Walmart, Amazon, Target, what? Uh, what else is out there? TJ Maxx, Marshalls. So many items that people can really purchase at other places, but if they want to support, they can support. The reason why I said that is many people are saying Kylie and Travis Scott is actually broke up. So they have to spin it to not speak about the breakup. Many people are saying a lot of the girls are single. What are they going to talk about? What are they going to put out? They have to put out media stuff like they normally do. Every two days, every three days, but people have literally been calling them out. Now, mind you, when they mentioned that Kylie and Travis broke up, many were like not surprised. And it didn't really take off like every like I think they wanted. I think many people were still saying, oh, this is the to strike away from Balenciaga. This is distract away from the K's and the J's trying to speak up for Tristan. This is a to distract away from uh, Kanye. What's really going on with Kanye? But then Kanye was really with a bay or a boo. You know, he was with Bianca, you know, getting to know her and to find out <laughs> Kanye is married, allegedly. And there's all these statements coming out from Kim, so they're trying to distract. So I think this is fake. I really do. That's why I'm not even going to mention what is being said because I'm not promoting. It's not a paid promotion. It's not a paid ad. This is the biggest thing. They want people to talk about the products. And allegedly, allegedly, fair use, a lot of customers are literally complaining. I saw a video where a young lady got a package by mistake, allegedly, wasn't her items. And it was alleged sold out items. So then she was asking for the items that she paid for. Can you at least give me the items that I paid for? And I'm going to send this girl her package. They were basically like trying to give her a hard time about getting her money back. And giving her a hard time if you send the package back, we'll consider something. That's what it said. The lady on TikTok was furious. What do you mean? I have to send this package to her and you'll consider giving me my money back? That's the biggest thing. How did they mix up a package, send it to the wrong person? Somebody might have literally put the wrong label on and sent maybe the package to the other lady to the other lady. Who knows? But the biggest thing is a lot of people are making comments about products. Now, say for instance, an item might be a small medium but you really should have bought a large or extra large. But who knows if they actually bought the wrong size. Many people are allegedly complaining about the sizes, cutting into the skin, items being too thin. Most of the fabric should be at least two, 
you know, two layers. No one wants anything that sheer. Now, mind you, other companies got in trouble for making items too sheer because women want to be protected because guys will say something. Hey, girl, you know, you're showing your stuff, but here nor there. So when you go on TikTok, fans are just going in. Some of these people will unbox items to talk on their, you know, TikTok or on YouTube, on, you know, Facebook. They'll promote items. So if they're not satisfied with it, and it's concern, I could not believe all the frustrating complaints and things are saying, when you look at this, this does not look like this is going to fit an adult. So I get that shapewear is supposed to be shapely and it's supposed to do what it's supposed to do. And I remember when she was doing an event and she was saying, hey, you know, I have on one or two pairs of shapewear. Do I need to put on another one? I'm thinking, you don't, what, what, <laughs> when you're putting on extra layers, you're actually adding more inches to your body, but here nor there, well wishes, they're looking to push, promote, just to get people talking, period, and why I say that is, I'll do that in another video, well wishes, I think this was pl plotted plan, they want to get people to start talking about Kylie in a different way. They don't want them to speak about Kylie and Travis Scott. They want her to be like now an individual because why would you say dot, 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 and then dot, 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 and then people are saying, oh, she kind of checked her, please. This is fake. It's to promote and it's to show. And then you'll probably see the other sister doing something in regards to. Now, mind you, the other thing, they had had an event I want to say last month, and allegedly the mom talked about all the items and left Courtney out. Isn't that a trip? Isn't that a trip? How do you do that? How do you do that? How do you how do you do this for your all your children and then you just allegedly, maybe it was cut off, I could be wrong, but leave Courtney off. And it's crazy to me. It's crazy how Courtney is treated. It's crazy how Rob is treated. It's just a sad situation. Everybody, most parents will say, I treat them all as an equal. We don't see that. We see that allegedly Kylie and Kim wants the mom's attention, period, period. I saw a video where um, the mom had took a call and um, she had answered and Kim was frustrated. They were in a meeting and it's like, this is why da, 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 da. She has the health concern she has. There's always something going on with the family and they're trying to pull her from this meeting. And it's like, she's a mom. She can't just be there for you and not take care of the other kids. But here and there. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for supporting the channel. Don't forget to like, to comment, and also subscribe. And also, this is the other thing that was being talked about. I'll probably show it. The mom, Chris, and Kendall are trying to... Uh, promote uh uber eats they're trying to do an ad they're trying to push ads they're trying to get brand deals so let me know in the comments how you feel about chris jenner this is basically saying chris jenner can literally monetize anything this woman is whatever a legend Oops. i ain't gonna say all that and then there's the comment about the cucumber why kendall was allegedly cutting it's always something they always have to sometimes embarrass themselves to get people talking. It's all fake. It's all fake. So let me know in the comments how you feel about them doing an ad in regards to um, Uber Eats, trying to sell something, trying to promote something, trying to get their name attached to something because maybe the brand deals, Kylie Cosmetics, whether people are supporting, not supporting, don't know. Whether people are supporting other brands that they're selling, I don't know. But they're trying to promote something that became a big conversation in regards to how she was cutting it. And they say she eats extremely healthy. She doesn't know why she did it that way. She does. It was plotted plan. Everything's plotted plan. People need to stop being fooled. But what wishes? Note in the comments how you feel about Kylie's situation, um, her trying to say X, Y, Z, and the sister saying, hey, dot, dot, dot. I'm not going to promote it, so... I'm only showing this is because it's on this part of the ad. But let me know in the comments. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for supporting the channel. Don't forget to like, to comment, and also subscribe.